there's a soul seed within us that has all the genetic and water intelligence memory of the universe within us. The seed has the entire story, has the entire remembrance of the path, the future that it sits before us is already known within the seed. Keeping this seed from sprouting is perhaps a sense of scarcity around the concept of love. It's desiccated the seed. We fear that there's not enough love for ourselves, for those around us. We've become afraid that perhaps the fabric of everything is love, and yet we look around at the struggles of love in human experience and relationship, relationship to the planet. If we dig deeper than the emotion that might be described as love or the physical vibration of it, there's a deeper truth within the universe of the quantum state. Physics of everything, the fabric of everything is not love, it's actually beauty. When you start to consider the possibility that there is no end to beauty, when you start to really steep in the abundance of beauty within the sunset, within the smell of the food that you are about to consume with the loved ones that sit around a table with you, the new friends that sit at that table to give you new enrichment, thought, genetic input, vibrational input. Step away from your clean to love. Let go of that, open your hands, and welcome in the observation of beauty. Your entire neurologic system has been tuned to give an extraordinary capacity for appreciating the beauty of the universe. the Milky Way at night, the solar eclipse, the vibration of the ocean as it pounds on a beach, all of your senses are tuned to be an observer of the beauty of the universe, when you shut down the human psyche and become an observer of beauty, you will immediately experience an overflow of a much truer vibration of love than you've perhaps ever had. You will realize that love has no end to it because it is not a thing. It is an experience. experience of witnessing beauty. And if we are at the heart chakra of the universe, then let us fall in love with the entire matrix of the universe through seeing all of its beauty. Turn to the person next to you tonight, and perhaps without words, stare into their eyes and start to be witness to the beauty. Each iris is like a supernova of intelligence and coloration, a star field within that pupil. Look into each other's eyes with your parent, your grandparent, the bedside of a hospital bed. Look into the eyes of another human being. See the freaking beauty there. overwhelmed by the miracle of vital life, the expression of a soul through a biological veil. Be in awe of the vibrations you can feel off of the skin of that person as you hold their hand. 
crepe paper texture of the soft skin of your elder as they lay in bed. The texture of a child's fingers in your hand as you walk by their side. Me and all. We're here on purpose. We are enough. The journey is okay. We can be free of judgment of our own shortcomings, acknowledge our nascent state, let go of fear and guilt, make space for new vibrational density, look to your food, your water, your company, your social networks, communities, for opportunities for new connection, reconnection, hyper-intelligence through our proximity to one another. Everything can shift. I'm so grateful we witnessed all of you this energetic space. So empowered by your presence in my life. I have come to find myself to be beautiful this year. It's all I desire for you. As you would see your own beauty. You are a sacred beauty.